in this question double integration is there so we have to check the order first dy by dx that means first we should integrate with respect to y okay so 0 to 2 we can write aside e power y by x 0 to x square dy this we can solve first and then after that we can uh, integrate with respect to x now see if we are uh, taking integration with respect to y so x will term will be treated as constant so 0 to 2 and we know integration of exponential is same so e power y by x and then we should multiply with the derivative of y by x derivative with respect to y we should take okay so that will be 1 by x because 1 by x will be taken as coefficient so derivative of y, y by x with respect to y will be 1 by x outside and then derivative of y that means 1 by x is the final derivative which should be divided here <clears throat> then 0 to 2 x will go up e power y by x between the limit also 0 to x square between the limit 0 to x square so first we should write the limit so x will be same x is coefficient so that means we are going to apply y value only this is y value we integrated with respect to y so these are the y values x will remain same y value we should substitute so 0 to 2 x and here 1 x we can cancel minus e power 0 is 1 okay so <coughs> this full function has become a function in the form of x so we can separate it separate the integral and for this integration by parts we can use derivative of x integral e power x between the limit 0 to 2 okay so 0 to 2 integral will come here and here x square by 2 power rule we can use is between the limit 0 to 2 so x e power x will remain same derivative of x is 1 e power x will remain same between 0 to 2 and this will be 4 by 2 minus 0 means 2 only and here apply 2 e square minus e square minus 2 okay and then for uh, if we apply for 0 minus 2 i wrote for, for this if we apply with 0 so this term will go but minus minus plus 1 will remain because e power 0 is there okay better i'll write this step again first we are substituting value 2 so 2 e square minus e square then value 0 so first term will become 0 next term will become e power 0 and then finally this minus 2 so 2 e square minus e square we can write e square minus minus plus 1 minus 2 so finally e square minus 1 is the answer